Suppose you wish to construct a confidence interval for the slope of the true linear regression line. The calculator can do this, and here's how. Consider the following example. Suppose we have the following data values, and we will first enter in these data values into L1 and L2. Right, now that we have finished entering in these lists, we can go ahead and construct the confidence interval for estimating the slope of the true regression line. And in order for us to do that, we will go ahead and hit STAT, scroll over to TESTS, and then scroll up until you get to LINREG TINT. We'll go ahead and enter in the X list as L1, that is the X coordinates of my data values, and Y list will be L2, this is the Y coordinates of the data values. The frequency will keep it 1, and the confidence level will go ahead and set that to be 0.95, or 95% confidence. We'll go ahead and put the regression equation into Y1 by hitting VARES, scrolling over to Y VARES, selecting function, and then selecting Y1 from that menu. Then we'll go ahead and calculate. Now the things that are being displayed here are as follows. We have the regression equation. In this case it's written in statisticians format, not in the regular algebra format. Then we have our confidence interval for the true slope. We have the estimated slope, the slope computed from the data. We have the degrees of freedom. Then we have the standard error, and this is the square root of the ratio of the sum of squares of the residuals divided by n minus 2. A is the y-intercept of our regression line, and this arrow here indicates that there's more information to see. So we scroll down, and here we see the coefficient of determination and here we see Pearson's correlation coefficient. And this is how you may conduct a linreg tint command on the TI-84 calculators. This command is not available on TI-83 calculators, so it is only available on TI-84 calculators.